everyone. Welcome to Joyous. This week we've got a fun show planned because we're going to be styling live um, some looks, great looks for work. We've got Michaela Tianlin and our very own special guest is Ruthie Grody this week, who is the CEO and founder of Bailey 44, one of our very favorite brands here at Joyous. As we get started on the topic of workwear, how have things changed for all of you from your first job to now in terms of what you wear to work? Well, immediately I start to think about how my makeup has evolved over time from the beginning when I first started working until now. I think the thing that stands out the most for me is in the beginning, I would always just throw on an outfit and then let my makeup come second. Mm -hmm. So I thought, well, if my makeup looks great and it looks pulled together, you know, my outfit's gonna look great. And I've sort of reversed the roles now. I think about my makeup first, and then I style my outfit second. So it's just a little bit of a switch, and I find that when I do that, I can make more out of my outfits because I can pair a fun lipstick with it or find a cool eye color, eyeshadow to pair with it. It's a little more thoughtful. Very cool, yeah. yeah. So I, I remember my first um, job, my outfits were super boring. <laughs> I remember a lot of pinstripes, <laughs> uh, you know, buttoned up shirts, you know, Flared leg trousers. Mm. You guys remember? Yeah, yeah. the flared jeans yeah. for me. Yeah. 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 So I had a lot of that going on. Oh, yeah? Yeah, yeah. But really? Right. Way better than mm. how I was wearing them then. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, I think, you know, it's now work wears a lot more fun and makes going to work a lot more fun, which mm. is, you know, something we all want to enjoy mm -hmm. going to work. Mm -hmm. But, you know, I think I personally really love the tailored look. And, you know, that makes it really easy for me now because you can wear something, you know, that I would wear anyway to the office. So, mm -hmm. yeah. Well, I agree with you. Um, being a veteran in this business, Business. Um, I remember there were a lot more constraints in the workplace for women, and now it's completely acceptable to, the traditional things still stay, the slim skirt, the blazer. So nowadays we have different kinds of fabrications that weren't offered in women's clothes before, and it's very acceptable mm -hmm. to wear clothes from the office, just take off the jacket that you wore that day, and put on some high heels or a beautiful necklace, refreshing up your yeah. makeup, and oh, you're ready to go out. And another great thing about today, and especially our clothes, nowadays, um, it's great that you can wear the clothes that you wore to work, mm -hmm. and then at night, which also gives you great perceived value for your clothes, which we all love. Yeah, I mean, who doesn't love stuff you can wear in the morning and in the evening? And I think, I think you just hit on it. I remember when my first job was on Wall Street, and at that point, like, it was all suits, but more precisely, you couldn't even wear a pantsuit because that was considered sort of rogue, right. right? It was like the black skirt and the black blazer. And I feel like now, I can't remember the last time I put a matching skirt and matching blazer together. So even when I go to something very formal, I'm always mix and match, like always. Like the idea of a head-to-toe look. Well, a head-to-toe look anymore. is yeah. a big no-no in yeah. our industry. Yeah, it doesn't work um, anymore. For us now, now uh, yeah. one of the big don'ts yeah is do not do the matchy-matchy look. So. <laughs> good to know, good to know. At least, at least I've gotten something right without knowing it. Um, mm -hmm. But you're right, you never see it anymore. You no. never see the head-to-toe look. So now we're gonna get to the fun stuff and see the looks that the three of you have put together. Let's go. All right, let's, let's go. Let's do it. <laughs> Gorgeous. Yeah. All right, and Ruthie. Tell us what we have. Well, I love this workday outfit because it has a dual purpose. Um, this stripe is a little bit different than the ordinary stripe. Notice her sleeve has a touch of the color of the season, which is a cobalt. It's great mix and matching. And I love it paired back to the knee length eco leather Ponte skirt. You'll notice that the side panels are made of Ponte and the eco leather actually molds right to her body, front and back. I mean, because the stripe is, it stands out on its own, especially with the detailing, I wanted to keep it a little bit more simple. Mm -hmm. um, two pieces I think is great for work if you want to layer up, um, but it really didn't need too much, just a few statement pieces. Mm. And with the makeup and the hair, I really love a clean and classic look for the day. And we have this palette from Jouer Cosmetics that I am obsessed with. And if you check out the componentry, everything fits together. Rachel is wearing it. She's got her eyeshadow, the cheek color, the lip color, and even the highlighter is all in this palette. You look great. <laughs> all right, Ruthie. Well, she's wearing our very favorite pant. And this is our number one item on our line. It's super comfortable, really molds to the body. Turn around to show how beautiful these pants fit. It's all about the fit. 
fit is key on ba for Bailey 44. She can wear this look to work, and she's wearing a beautiful top, and it's actually the color of the season, which is a cobalt. All right. Because the top is so light and then the pants are so slim, I wanted to keep the jewelry a little bit more on the delicate side. Mm -hmm. um, I love layering mixed metals. She's got mm -hmm. gold and some silver going on on the neck. But, you know, I'm tying into the silver with the bracelet and then also the earrings. And for the hair, I really love the Soltra Bombshell Curling Iron. It gives you, even if you have like stick straight hair, if you just want a little bit of bend and a little bit of volume and movement, Now for our last look, this amazing dress from Bailey wow. 44. I love this color. Me yeah, too. Well, pretty. here again, showing the cobalt blue. This is a new length coming this fall, which is to the knee, and you'll also see it for next spring. This color block dress really accentuates her waist. And turn around a second. Notice we have the little peekaboo detail in the back, just exposing just a little bit of skin. skin. That's okay Not for work, much. right? Just a touch. I love this. It's just like take 10 pounds off immediately. Exactly. It's like kind of sexy. That's man. kind of why we did it. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's, hard, it's hard not to look good. And you were talking about the length is also just amazing. Yes. It's, 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 it's hard a not super to look sexy good. length. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. This dress, sure. I mean, it is so beautiful on its own. You really don't need a lot. Oh, you can either wear like it with a single Pretty. pendant piece. Like I this. love this pendant. Yeah, wow, that's gorgeous. beautiful. It's yeah. not beautiful, it's just great. Yeah. Or if you really want people to notice you in the office place and also after work for drinks, a this layer. is an amazing look. Mm. Trust me, you're going to turn heads. Gorgeous. And you can keep your hair up. You can throw it into a bun if you're going out at night. Throw on a red lipstick I think would look gorgeous with this. And yeah, complete look. So we've just seen some great looks, which is amazing. Um, but before we wrap up, any parting wisdom or tips for the women on what to do or not do when it comes to workwear? Well, one thing I think, you know, and of course this is coming from the accessories standpoint, is a lot of the time when you're at the workplace, you're seen from the waist up. You know, mm -hmm. you're in a lot of meetings, you're sitting at your computer. Mm -hmm. So when it comes to accessories, keeping something bold that's going to be, you know, from the waist up is the best way to get the most out of your accessories. Mm -hmm. yeah. I like that. I like that too. Cool. That's a good tip. Well, for beauty, I know how easy it is just to get stuck in a rut and put the same thing on every single day. Oh, yeah. A lot of my clients, a lot of my friends, they don't even sometimes wear makeup. They'll end up just throwing anything that they have on, they have in their bathroom on. So, was talking about me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so if anything, I say go for a lipstick if you want something super easy and pull it together. And don't wear sparkles. I think we all know that rule, but just as a reminder, Excellent. they're coming back up in beauty, but I think there's a fine line of wearing Definitely. a little bit of yeah. shimmer and still doing that gracefully rather than doing like the chunky sparkle glitter stuff. So right. you're safe with that. <laughs> well, being a joyous mm -hmm. and a working mom, mm -hmm. one of the things I love the most is that you can shop at Joyous and you could be at the workplace or work break and I love that you can do two things at once. So the multitasking, and we do actually see it. A lot of our buys come during the day, which I think speaks to oh, the really? trend funny. of women basically fulfilling through direct because it's actually simply too hard to get to the store right. um, to buy something. Um, one last question for you, Michaela. Yes. Nail art, how nail funky art. can you go in the office? So I think nail art is so it's such a fun accessory. It's an easy way to incorporate a fun color or a trend into your look if you weren't necessarily really inspired to incorporate it into your wardrobe. So one look I'm really loving right now is the ombre effect, which I actually just had on my nails from my nail artist. And basically you just take the same color family, maybe one or two shades and paint a darker color on three nails. And then you accent it with a similar shade in that family range, just for a little fun. A little Gorgeous. fun kind of like nail art and metallics are really big for fall, dark colors, wine stain colors. And all wearable to work. Yeah. Oh yeah, absolutely. All right, okay. <laughs> With that, thank you, Ruthie, for joining us. Thank you for having me. Uh, yeah. um, before yeah. we wrap up, we actually have one of the amazing blue biotech dresses that you saw um, in the styling session is our giveaway for today. All you need to do is share with us your favorite fashion do or don't uh, for the workplace. And with that, we'll show you a preview of what's up this week on Joyous. And thanks very much for joining us.